So this is going to be my September Ipsy bag. So this one came um, kind of on time. It was a little bit late. I think it came like the 17th or 18th. And here's the pretty pink packaging. I can't get myself to throw it away. They're so pretty. Um, but it came with some nice things. It came on the 17th, yeah. Um, and usually it's supposed to come around the 15th. I usually get mine a little bit later than some other people, but I'm still excited. And actually my friend who now does Ipsy, like, she gets it, like, later, like a few days after I get it, but we live in, like, the same area, so it's kind of weird. So first it came with an, um, M. Michelle Fawn, like, tester for her palettes, um, and, like, she's the owner of Ipsy. So it makes sense that she would like throw in something to like advertise a little bit, you know? So it comes with a blush um, and some eyeshadows. And this is just a little sample. I'll probably put this in my project pan um, because this kind of stuff I really don't need a lot around. Um, but that's good, self-promotion. And this would probably be like a free one. Um, yeah, so the theme this month was Classic Beauty. And there are a bunch of different um, companies this month and different amounts off. And here is the bag. It is such a pretty blue bag as you can see. I love my blues. Yeah, I like my blues a lot. So, um, I love this bag. It's like a lacy print with like little flowers and butterflies and stuff. Um, and so Ipsy has their own bags. Um, and I'll link my Ipsy, um, on my channel and I, I guess down below too. Um, if you want, if you think about Ipsy, go for my link and I'll be very happy because it will get me points and I can get free stuff and yeah. So if you're thinking about Ipsy, like I'm not sponsored, I pay the like $10 a month um, and it's a really good deal. You get like four to five products and each one of them is like, like, one, like five or $10. So it's a good deal. Um, so first thing we got were these three facial masks and this one is the free they're by Freeman and this one is the hydrating paper mask the brightening rose mask and the purifying star fruit mask and this is the blue I gave by the way I like the blue one just because the packaging I like it um but yeah so these are like one use each might be like fun if you're doing like a sleepover or something um, I don't know how well they're going to work, but I can try them. And when I do get makeup, like, sometimes they give more skincare and stuff, but when I do get, like, actual makeup, I like to do looks, even, I'm not getting sponsored or anything to do looks, I just think it's, like, a fun challenge to make up a look with what you, you got. Um, so this month they give out four makeup products. Um, so these are worth, like, $2 each, so it's, like, $6 right there. But, yeah. So they gave out makeup. So the first item I got was the Starlux um, eyeliner in Obsidian. And this one's supposed to be pretty good. This one is worth um, $12. So it's, it's a good, this is a good full size. And these are full size too. Um, but yeah. So I'm, I've am i heard that it's a really good liner. That it, um, it's really pigmented and nice. But as you can see I already have some other liners. And if you look at my project pan open. So I don't want to open this new one. But um, it's a nice one if you don't have a black because everybody likes black liner. I was kind of hoping, you know, that we would get, like, something fun, you know? Like, that's the, like, point of Ipsy, getting new stuff that you don't usually buy. Like, I don't know. But it's another black one. I'll put it in my collection. I'm not going to open it until I have a need for it because I have, like, five liners. And, yeah. Um, so next... We have a little travel size of the It's So Big Mascara. <laughs> and it's kind of an oxymoron because it's tiny. And it's funny. It's a little innuendo there. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I thought it was, it's just like a little travel sample size. The full one of this is worth um, 20 so it's about $8. Um, it's like less than half, but like I find mascaras, I'm still using one that I bought like four months ago. Um, so like the little ones last me like three months or something, three or four months and the big ones last me like five or six. So I'm not going to open this one cause I have like five in my project pan again, but it is a nice mascara. Um, it's got like, I've heard the brush is kind of like an hourglass shape or something. 
Okay, so next, um, Jcast Beauty, which we've gotten before. We got a lot, we usually get a lot of Star Looks and Jcast, um, and NYX in our bags. Um, this is the Fantabulous Lipstick. And, um, it's like a really nude lipstick. And this is in Honey Crisp. And it's this new color. I don't wear nude colors because I feel like this is gonna, like, wash out my face. But it might be nice to try. As you can see, I'm not wearing anything right now. And my lips are pretty pigmented. So, um, it's nice to try out. Um, I feel like Jcast is kind of like, um, a ripoff of, like, NYX a little bit. Because most of the packaging and products are the same. Like, this is the same as the NYX, um, matte lipsticks. The same packaging. Like, literally. Let me get one of the mattes. Get the same packaging. And at first, I, just was, I thought it was actually NYX, but it's not. Um, and, like, they have, if you look online, a bunch of their products are just, like, NYX products. They're usually actually a little bit less expensive. Um, this one's only worth $2.50, this lipstick, whereas these are, like, 6 bucks at Ulta. So, they're less expensive. Um, I don't know if they're better than NYX or if they're the same quality, but I feel like they do have a lot of the same products that NYX has. Um, and this one is, you can get, the Starlux you can get 20% off, Big Cast you get 25% off, and the It's So Big actually get 50% off, so that's like a mascara for $10, that's like a pretty good deal. And then the masks, um, 40%, 44% off as a free gift, so that's good. Um, so I'll just swatch this. I have like an, um, orange skin tone color, as you can see. Um, there it is. So I might play around with this because I really don't have any nude lipsticks. So it's kind of a nice thing because we usually get pinks or reds, but it's different. Like this is nice, but I don't know how much I'm going to use it. But it might be fun to do because I love doing different looks. So here it is. And last but not least, I got the NYX, which I love NYX. And this is the um, eyeshadow in Kryptonite. Um, yeah, and it is this dark, like, it's this grayish black color with, like, a bunch of glitter, so I don't know how much I'm going to be wearing this, but it's pretty, I guess. Um, I was hoping for, like, a different kind of color, because this really isn't, like, something I'm going to wear. Um, like, a fun color or something different, because, like, I already have, like, something like this, I feel that even though I don't really wear it, and I'm not really going to wear something like this, but they had like so many different colors you could have got in your bag. Um, I was hoping to get like a um, coppery color or something like that, but I guess this would be nice to try out. Um, so it's got like a lot of product in here, and I'm thinking about like trying to depot everything because these take up a lot of room. Um, but it is very um, good, it's pretty good quality, it's very um, creamy and nice. So here's like the color shimmery grayish black color. Here it is. It's kind of, um, it's not like as dark as it looks in here, but it's still a pretty color. So I think I'm going to be doing a tutorial with this. I think that my tutorial is going to be like a galaxy eye tutorial because I feel like this bag would work really well for that, especially this, um, this shadow. It reminds me a lot of like stars and like the night sky. I don't know if you can pick up the shimmer, but it's a very shimmery color. Um, so I think this will be fun to work with. And these are like around $4.50 at Ulta. Now they actually sell NYX at Target, which is nice. Um, so I think that will work quite nice with a nude lip. And um, I don't know if I'm going to use black liner and mascara. I'll probably use this like black liner mascara, but not these ones. I don't know yet. But yeah. So that's my bag. Um, I thought it was pretty good this month. My favorite product, probably, I don't know what my favorite product is. I haven't really tried anything that much yet. Um, if this works nicely, it'd probably be this because I don't really have anything like it. Um, but we'll see what I like the most. Um, again, I got all this for $10, like no extra shipping costs or anything like that. And, um, so the value of my bag in particular was $33. That's pretty good. That's, like, like, triple what you're paying. And you're getting a nice bag, and you're getting free shipping. So it's a pretty good deal. Um, 
So some of the other things you could have bought, you could have got was like, there's a really pretty butter London nail polish and this like really dark color, like red color. They had a Jessie's Girl liquid liner, Caitlyn tinted lip balm, um, like shampoo and conditioner, which I'm glad I didn't get. I don't want that kind of stuff, you know? Um, and there was a Chella Ivory Lace Highlighter, Pop Beauty Crayon, Firming Eye Gels, which that would have been cool to try. I don't know. I don't really need that kind of stuff, but um, still. And then a Victoria Jackson um, Taupe Brow Pencil. Um, so I think it's a pretty cool bag. Um, some, they seem to be repeating products a lot, like the, um, pencil, the pop beauty, um, and, like, yeah, like, at least two or three items they've, like, done before, so I guess the companies are still giving them the same deals, but I'm, I think they're trying to give it to people they haven't given it to, given it to before, but yeah. So that's my bag for September or whatever, um, yeah. If you like my new channel, like, I really decided that the name was, like, really weird. My old name, I didn't really think about it before making it. Like, Bath Body Works Fanatic 100. BD, BBW Fanatic 100. It's, like, actually, like, BBW. I realized after I made it. It's, like, Big Beautiful Women, like, porn or whatever. Um, which I'm not, like, that kind of person. So, um, yeah. Yeah. So I made a new one, Makeup Army 22, which I think is, like, a lot more me, at least. <laughs> um, I, like, I love mermaids and under the sea, love makeup and stuff like that, so. And 22 is my, like, lucky number, so. I had to pick a number because someone already took my name, Makeup Mermaid, so. But, yeah. So it'll be MM22, which hopefully doesn't stand for anything. Um, yeah. Makeup Mermaid 22, check it out. Subscribe if you like my videos. I'll keep trying to post them. I'm trying to get onto a more regular schedule instead of um, like uploading like 10 videos on the weekend, like when I have time to edit and upload. Um, I'm gonna try and do like two a week. Hopefully that's gonna work and I'm not gonna like have them back up like every month. I'll post like 10 videos or something and then like wait another month. Um, it's just I'm busy with school and all my other life, so yeah. So I hope you like my new video. Bye. Like nudie skin skin coat skin skin whatever that word is. 